that loop. A okay. Okay, the first one is going to be 55 train uh, FMJ 223. You got it. You got it. You got one behind it? You got two behind it. There's still one standing. There's still one jug standing. Okay, but did it penetrate the log and get them? Yes. 55 grain FMJ went through approximately four inches of wood. Hit on the right hand side of the log, went through a thin spot. Anything else? The other jug that was hit was a mess on the log and it clipped the side of the jug. Okay, this is on tape. Affirmative. Range is going hot and we're using the same 55 grain full metal jacket 223. Negative! Now we are using three rounds of 62 grain, 223 full metal jacket. I don't see no water splattering anywhere, but the first and third shots went clean through. I can see shit flying. Okay, now repeat what you just told me. Show it. Okay, the 223 expended its energy coming out of the wood. And it stopped there before it hit the water And jug. it stopped there before it hit the water jug. See, you know what, Lawrence? We should have checked it after my three shots. Yeah, we should have. You know. Holy shit. That's the back end that, that's, Show Lee that one! There's, there's the 223. <laughs> that's how far it gets. Hard, <laughs> but unfortunately, we don't know if it was the 62 or the 55 because okay. we didn't check Here's the bullet he fired. It went somehow or other, I don't know how, it got turned around by the sump, it went spinning, buzzing back and landed about six or eight feet in front of him. And you can see that's, I don't know if you're focusing on this, but that's fine. it's uh, flattened and the tip is bent in a, the tip being bent probably steered it in a funny direction, I'm thinking. Anyway, for curiosity's sake, they're going to look at the, at the uh, bullet track. Yeah. How the hell did they do that? They just whip around the curve of the rock and the log? They do funny things sometimes. It, it could have been turned, Lee, Tom thinks it could have been turned 90 degrees inside the wood, and it appears to have green paint on it. So maybe it, uh, or something green on it, which could be paint, so figuring maybe it hit the framework somewhere and deflected back at us. And who's seen it come back? Uh, no, uh, uh, what's his name? Joe, is it? The reenactor guy? I keep forgetting his name wrong. Anyway, he, he's got pretty good eyes. Well, I heard it, I, but I thought it was a skyrocket or something. But uh, Joe saw it come, you know, sputtering into the grass just ahead of Lee. I think he got it. Now, what grain of bullet was that again, Dennis? That was a 7239 by 39. Uh, and something like 123, 125, 125. Very good. No, no new exit hole. Net and the Russian 7.6 total by 39. 